Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are looking for a cheap and perfect summer gloves, I think I found one. So stay tuned. So hello and welcome in my secondary kingdom. Uh, in today's video I'm going to talk about motorcycle gloves. So if you are not interested, just skip it. And if you are looking for a good and cheap motorcycle summer gloves, I think you should watch this video. This video is not sponsored by anyone. Uh, all the gear you will see in this video I paid with my own money. So, these summer gloves for your motorcycle guys. Well, these are my Revit Dirt 3 gloves which I'm using for the last five years. I made a review video about them uh, some time ago. If you haven't seen it, I'm going to put a link somewhere there. These are very good gloves, summer gloves. They are leather gloves with good protection. They are quite comfortable and they durable. This is my second pair. My first pair I was uh, using for three years and then the tops of my fingers went broke. There was a hole in my, in my finger. So I had to buy new ones. But three years in, in one set of gloves, I think uh, that's quite a lot. And I was riding in dry weather, sometimes when there's more rain. Uh, of course, the hands are sweating. So three years, not bad, I would say. So I bought myself a second pair and I'm still happy with them. They are very good gloves. There is only one problem. In the summer when it's very hot and the temp got very high, human body begin to sweat. And the sweaty hands are the biggest enemy of uh, motorcyclists. Because when you have uh, sweaty hands, it is very difficult to remove or put on your gloves. These gloves are ventilated here on the fingers and here, but they are good until 26 degrees Celsius. When the temp goes above 26 degrees Celsius, then begins the sweaty problem. So I decided I'm going to look for some other gloves uh, for the very hot summers when the temp goes very high. And I was looking for something very well ventilated, uh, something that takes not so much space so I can take with me as a spare gloves and something that is comfortable. So I went to the motorcycle outlet and I found these. These are LS2 summer gloves. And LS2 brand is known from its helmets. They made very good helmets. And at first I thought they don't make any other um, riding gears. So these are probably Chinese fakes. But after some research I find out that these are actually original SL2 uh, gloves. They called LS2 Cubra. They are very very cool and very very cheap so first of all as i mentioned these are cheap gloves so it's a budget glove but the quality is really really amazing you'll see they are very very light comparing to them yeah it's it's a very big difference these are much lighter uh, they are made from a fake leather, or was it called sweat, uh, nubuk, whatever you call it, it is fake. Uh, that's why they cheap. They have a very good ventilation, as you can see they have a lot of mesh on it. Um, underneath on the finger and they have uh, the ventilation holes on, on each finger. And as I mentioned, they are very light. And what I like the most about them, they are incredibly comfortable. They are so soft. After some 
writing, you just don't feel them on your hands. You just have the feeling that you're writing without gloves, which is great because not all the gloves are that comfortable. So, protection. They have a soft uh, thing here, soft rubber or soft, uh, I don't know what it is, but it is soft here. Uh, it has uh, knuckle protection, it's a rubber. It's quite, quite strong, I think. And some protection on these two fingers. It's a rubber as well. Closing on the wrist is a Velcro, quite strong Velcro. And you can adjust here how much space you want to have here so you can have them a little bit loose or you can tie them up. And it is working perfectly. I'm using these gloves since March, so it is five months. And there is some small damage. Uh, you can definitely see that they were used, but I'm sure they can handle about two uh, motorcycle seasons. Um, after that they're probably going to break here, because this is the weak point here. But, until now, they're performing really good. Another cool feature in these gloves is this. This is the uh, touch panel thingy on the, on the um, index fingers in both um, uh, gloves, so left and right, which this one doesn't have and they not working so good with the phone of navigation. Navigation is a little bit better. I don't have much problems with navigation, but my phone I always have to remove the glove. These ones not necessary. They are working perfectly. When I bought these gloves, they were connected with these loops to the uh, to the packaging, and theoretically, here are the scissors, which means you should cut this off when uh, before use. But I decided to leave it because I can do that and I can hang my gloves anywhere I want, which is handy. But of course you don't have to do that. This is not uh, bothering me when the gloves are on. I don't feel that thing, so I don't mind. I think I find it actually very handy. And now the best uh, part of this is the price. So, for example, the Revit uh, Dirt 3 gloves cost me about 90 euros, which is not very much for the gloves because the good gloves can cost up till 250 euros. These ones cost 40 euros. And again, it is fake leather, but they are so comfortable that for this price is really worth to buy them, even if they are only for one season. But I'm sure they can handle it two seasons at least. I am in Poland right now and I found these gloves even cheaper. Here in Poland on Allegro.pl, which is a Polish kind of eBay, you can buy them for 35 euros which is even better. And I think this is very good price quality ratio. And honestly, I like these gloves so much that I bought myself another pair, another color. You can buy these gloves in three colors, which are these, khaki or brown or whatever you want to call it, black with green, or totally black. So I think I found a perfect uh, glove solution, at least for me. They very well ventilated, they very comfortable and they very cheap. Th that's a real budget solution for your um, very hot summer. So if you go to the country where it's very hot, uh, somewhere on the south of Europe for example, then these gloves can save your 
sweaty hands. So I think for 40 euro, 35 in Poland, that's a um, pretty good deal. Well guys, thank you for watching. I'm gonna end this video now. I hope you like it. If you did, give me thumbs up and subscribe. If you like my videos, you can support my channel by clicking super thanks uh, button, which you can find below the screen. You can also buy me a coffee or make a small donation. All the information about that are in the description. For now, thanks for watching guys, and of course, see you in the next one.